infuriated about reconnecting to his roots. 19-year-old Tanner Ray returned to his hometown of Dewey last summer after he felt he lost touch with his community and friends. Beautiful day here in northern Oklahoma. Oh, it sure is. First official day of summer. Perfect day to grab the people you call friends and hit the lake. Sure wish we could. <laughs> I've always wanted to live. What the fuck is our slap city? What do you think, small town boy? In a, in a big, big city? Me and you, you and me, no more. They tossed the dice, it had to be. The only one for me is you. And you for me, so happy together. But now I'm back home. And the truth is, when I got back, I looked up and I was completely alone. All these kids I grew up with were all in separate paths. College, the military, even getting married. It was like their lives just started, but mine just ended. Before I even realized it, days turned into weeks. Weeks turned into months. By myself, I work out by myself, I edit by myself, I do everything just by myself. My life was just passing by. And couldn't even find motivation to get out of bed. And I was just letting it. That's the reality of my life. Yeah, it's hard for me to just like no, I know, but like, it's just like, I'm just so confused, dude. We've been friends since fucking third grade, bro. We grew up together. I went to your house, I rode my bike, I jumped on a trampoline. Too many memories. There is. We've had a lot of dumb ideas. Yeah. Like mustard versus trampoline. <laughs> mustard versus trampoline. We've definitely made hella memories together, that's for sure. Yeah. They say that if you're friends with someone for over seven years, then you're usually friends for life. Yeah. I mean, if I was going to be friends for life, then you might definitely be you. Well, yeah. It's crazy. You're the only friend I have that actually. Tanner, I know you've been struggling lately and feel like you don't have any friends. I really hate that for you because there's plenty of friends out there. Why don't you... Go make a video about trying to make new friends. So how do you make friends? The 
make friends, first, you have to talk to people. It's literally impossible to make friends if you don't talk to people. But how do you do that? I don't know. I suck at talking to people. So if you can't talk to people... Right here? Anyone? <laughs> Okay, if I'm being completely honest, that didn't work. I I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Like, I, I guess making friends is a lot harder than I originally thought. I don't know what to do. Like, you put in the work to find those friends. You know? Yeah. like. Or you put in the work to find that. So I don't think there's a problem at all. You just kind of got to take a step back. No one tells you all the kids you grew up with in school, all the kids you're close to, are soon gonna find their own path, and everyone was just gonna split ways. Like it's just, it's so weird. What if the best times of my life are already over? But then, out of nowhere, these kids came up to me and asked me what I was doing. Yo, it was good. I wanted to hang out with them. Well, this is Noah. Noah. Yeah, I met Noah. Did you guys? But yeah. Levi. You post videos so on the bro. internet, like TikTok. Oh uh, yeah, so something like that. What's your name? Grace. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Tanner. So TikTok or YouTube? Name? Both. Tanner. Jenner. Nice. Feels good. Let's go, bro. Zach. You guys are having a hell of a time over here. I just feel like I have so much to give as like a friend, but like I have no one to give it to. All of this, I feel like I have all of this love and I just, I just want to share laughs with someone. Just hang out and experience life with someone else. Anyone. A group of people. <laughs> Like, why am I here right now? I don't know. Download Live 360 right now. <laughs> yeah, we just met this guy today and he's already in our chest. What? <laughs> I'm like actually shaking. <laughs> Is it that scary? Yes, everyone in this building was staring at me. <laughs> Before I even realized it, I had friends. The type of friends you do everything with. Give them a kiss. A week ago, I felt like I had no one. Now I had this big friend group and was being dragged to things like ghost hunting. What is this? I'm scared. <laughs> oh, yo. Hell no. I could have stayed home and went to bed. I've never been in a girl's bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey guys. Hey. I take back anything mean I've ever said about you. <laughs> no, what? Where are you guys taking me? Roller coaster ride. Oh, it's not a cat. Oh, yeah, that, that's gonna end well. He's about to pull me behind his truck in a shopping cart. I want to do that. Okay, you try it first. Oh! No, no one's forcing you to do this. Live, yeah. You want me to hold your taquito? Just let me finish it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, I was standing on the fucking truck! <laughs>
Never thought I'd become friends with the truck kids. <laughs> I'm trying. But I don't think I've ever had this much fun in Oklahoma. What's your favorite memory about high school? Well, my French teacher would have us come out here on nice days on the football field and we would read our French books outside, which was fun. That sounds like a vibe. It was really cool. I feel like half my life I just didn't even, like, I wasn't conscious for it. Like, I feel like just recently in the last, like, year, I just, like, woke up and, like, started living. Like, everything kind of blended together, like, in at least high school for me. I feel like every day was, like, the same. Like, what's your favorite thing about just life in general? Probably people. People? Spending time with the people I love. I feel like that's literally the most important thing in life. I wish I realized that sooner. If you really think about it, if you're on your deathbed, no one's regrets can be like, oh, I wish I made more money, or I wish I bought more stuff. It's always like, I wish I spent more time with the people I care about. Uh, this is gonna teach you how to dance tonight. I'm, I have PTSD from last time. Well, that's why we're teaching you this time. Okay. Hey, you gotta work. I never understood why people would stay in Oklahoma their whole lives. But I think I'm starting to get it. Everyone seems a damn genius lately. Tick tock, talking late night TV is still so much I have yet to know. We get dressed up just to go downtown in some ego filled late night crowd. Seems to be where I feel most alone. This is where we um, are at the where are we at? Where are we at? Cavalcade Street Dance. Cavalcade! Yup, yup, let me just show y'all real quick, okay? This is Brandon and this is JC. This is Peyton. This is Abby. And then now I don't know anybody else. How do I turn this on? <laughs> Beginning of the summer, all I wanted was to leave and never come back. But now I don't want to leave. For the first time in my life, I love it here and I love these kids. Guess what? You'll live in your mind, so. Go! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh god. Oh. Man, it's slick. That's <laughs> crap. Hand boy runs off. Oh my god. But I'm scared that the summer's almost already over. What? <laughs> oh, oh, hey, you got it. Cowboy. That's right. Don't forget it.
Now, if you want to get real technical, <laughs> and though. I finally have friends again. Don't want to lose them. You should run my speaker so we can have music. I know, that would have been a five. You should knock on the glass. So, turn, open the window and turn the music on. Uh, can you turn the music yeah, up? Turn the music up! We're trying to music dance. up! None of us are promised tomorrow. Like, that's literally how I go every day thinking. Like, people think I'm crazy for not, you know, going to college or doing any of this stuff. But it's like, someday we're all gonna die, which is scary. But like, it makes me want to live more. Like, it makes me want to do the things I actually want to be doing instead of the stuff that people will tell me to do. Sometimes things feel like they'll last forever. But I'm starting to realize nothing does. You blink, moments become memories, kids become adults, and friends become strangers. Nothing is permanent. But I guess that's what makes a moment so special. You can never recreate it. One thing I admired about these kids is that's all they cared about. Right here, right now. Like everything, summer did come to an end. As much as I loved my new friends, deep down I knew I couldn't stay here. I've outgrown Oklahoma. But maybe it's starting to grow on me. Oh man, dude, this is insane. <laughs> Kyle, I love you. I hope you guys enjoyed the film. How do you guys feel being part of this movie tonight? Oh, it feels great. It's, it's awesome. awesome. It's awesome. Great. I'm excited for Tanner. What, cool. what kind of friend is Tanner? He's Amazing. Really great. Really good, good, good answer. Good answer. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Anything you want to add that hasn't been said? I don't know, I'm just really grateful to be out here, honestly, and I just want to say that anything is possible. You can do anything you put your mind to, and this, if this isn't proof of it, I don't know what else is. So. Alright, yeah. and you didn't tell me if you are going to do another project. Do you want to say anything about that now? Or? All I'm going to say is something might be going on in...